Another tip we're going to work on is uh, for your hip strength, leg strength, another general accessory. Mark's got a great one that they do around here at Super Training. You ought to be able to throw it into your workout and help you get better too. This is a squat good morning combination that we're going to have Silent Mike here do. Uh, Mike with no warm up is just going to kind of take this weight out. And you're going to see that he's kind of tight. So when he does a squat, he's going to lean forward. <clears throat> you're leaning forward a little bit, but he's still getting down there pretty good. And now he's going to do good morning. He's going to switch back and forth between the two. So this movement, he's stretching out his hamstrings when he's doing that. When he's doing the squat, he's stretching out his groin and his hips. So you're stretching the hamstrings and you're stretching the hips back and forth. This will kind of lubricate, lubricate you up a little bit for your workout that you're about to do. We're going to add a little bit more weight here. Go ahead and rack it. And we're going to show you. We're going to show you what his hips are doing as he's moving the weight. I want to show you on, on rack that for me. This guy, yeah. All right. So a lot of times, it's going to be, a lot of times an athlete, when they go to do a squat, do like a bad squat, like lean way forward. A lot of times they don't understand where their hips are. And they're like, I got below parallel, didn't I? And you're like, hell no, you didn't. <laughs> it's because they're not moving their hips throughout the entire range of motion. Your hips need to move the whole time just as they did there. Now he's going to do a good morning. This is teaching him how to move his hips. It's also teaching him where his hips are during the lift. Uh, we like to do about four of each, so about eight total repetitions. You go back and forth. You can also do the same variation of a stiff leg deadlift and a regular deadlift. This is a very uh, exhausting exercise, and it'll be a good one for you guys to fit into your program. This is something that I would add in in conjunction with doing a secure hip mobility program that I've got for you guys. Lips don't something lie. Something else that's going to help you get stronger, make you feel better, loosen things up, be a better athlete.